I got a lot of comments regarding Project Themer new update video. So yes, here it is what we have right now. Project Themer, one of the most interesting apps out there for Android theming for Android 12 or Android 12.1 so far. I made a video on this one a lot of time ago when it was free, but yes, now it's paid available on Google Play. So I'll talk about that later on. Let's take a quick look at the things which you have here by default. Yes, it's improved now if you compare it with the previous versions where I made a video on Project Themer. Now it's improved and installation is quite simple quite easy so might be a good choice for you but let's take a look at the things which you have themes colors gradient shapes brightness these are the things which you can customize if you move on and take a look at the themes one thing which is quite interesting i found here is the gradient one looks quite good by the way and you have this sky color the sky theming option available we have all these options available if i try to apply this theme gradient which in my case it's working perfectly fine the first time it showed me warning about in some customers it's not working but in my case it's working perfectly fine as if you're able to see it's just working perfectly fine so it looks quite good if you want to use this thing you can you can see without reboot my device has this kind of theming quick setting panel it's just working first time when you install project themer you need to reboot your device but after that to apply or change any kind of theming you don't need reboot so yes keep this thing in your mind by the way other than else things are basically looking quite good the theming is one of the most important thing in android community if you're android user if you're not theming your device what are you doing man you need to theme you have colors if you want to customize these colors for example as we just applied the gradient color if you try to apply this color then the color will be changed everywhere as you can see the theme has this ascent colors available but in my case i personally don't like ascent theming so yes i'll better delete i will battle i will better turn off this thing on my device for example i'll just turn off this thing colors i don't like this thing but yes it's just my opinion of course if you move on to the shapes where you can customize the quick setting tiles options the first one was theming now we have the tiles options for example if i want to apply this colors option you can apply this thing by the way let me try to change the rows the first thing which i liked here was uh, the theming but the bug which i got here is this as you can see it's still showing as four while i have tried the five by the way it might be the conflict it might conflict with the default uh, custom room as i'm using rice droid so things might be changed here but that's not a big deal if you restart your system yeah, things might work for you but yes most of the things should definitely work for you so yes might be worthy if you want to try it out on your device i also tried this it was working fine too didn't got any kind of major issues so far after using this thing and this is about this project themer this is something new which we have you can even customize the brightness sliders this is a brightness slider right now which i have i can even customize the ascent colors now i also have the option to customize like the gradient brightness slider for example i tried this as you can see without any reboot without any system you restart this theme is applied successfully so yes a lot of things are there which you can customize if you want to the option is here one thing which i found here is this this is the thing which i tried to disable i tried to use this amaze but it was not working i'm not sure though why as i just mentioned that i'm using rise droid custom it already includes all these themes and the arches theme is what i have installed by default i have applied by default the, this is not the default one so yes this might be the issue but yes as i just mentioned these are the device specific and these the things might be changed in my case only as i'm using a custom home, so there might be bugs in custom homes too so that's not a big deal you can install buy check it out if it is working for you it's great if it is not you can simply skip this thing you have the option for refund too so yes that's not a big deal other than else yes you have some customizations regarding quick settings fonts dpi which means you can customize the fonts etc you have also have the option for menu layout and uh, other stuff etc etc this is about this project themer so uh, if you check it out you can see this is what we have in settings kind of a troll which you can use if you want to so these are the things which you have here let me show you one more thing if you want to use this thing you need to download it from the google play store and yes i have as if you are gonna comment that i'm using a pirated app don't i'm using official version from google play store you can see that i have the option for refund so yes i purchased it if you want to you if you want to purchase it you can link is already there and this was all thanks for watching and goodbye